Fresh Edelweiss Weiss beer, and it's uh, good for 2016. Right on. So it appears to be fairly new, and it's um, yeah, I'm pretty sure from Germany here. Anyway, let's give this freaking beer a pour. You know what I'm saying? smelling mass produced euro lagerish and but a nice spicy note and kind of a lemony vibe very nice kind of yellowy hazy color there heads rapidly dissipating not too much for head performance out of this one of course bottle conditioned good for another year and um, there are I noticed the ingredients I've read this before we got um, some slightly uh, non ideal maybe things depending on your opinion so uh, water wheat malt barley malt hops yeast glucose fructose flavored unfiltered so there's a bit of flavoring and glucose so there's sugar but the flavoring might be some spices even you know I didn't say spices necessarily you think I'd say spices you know maybe not Wow, a lot of like orange, citrus, lemony tang, a bit of pepper, a lot like the saison I had last night, <laughs> very similar. It's a zero head per performance almost out of this, it's kind of creamy, a creamy note, it's warmer, more banana. A fair bit of banana. Bitter wheat beer coming together with a banana to make a clashing taste that actually is pretty nice. Yeah. Smells sugary. Um, of course, by the banana kind of the half type yeast flavor. The very <coughs> Belgian y. Really nice carbonation on it. All in all, it's a little bit light, which I guess can be a good thing, depending on what you're after. If you want a lighter, more refreshing wheat beer, this one would be, I guess that's why they call it the Snow Fresh. It's kind of, it almost gives you that sensation, you know. Here out with the snow. I don't know. For a refreshing, like, like lawnmower beer, something, this is really good. Could be a little bit better. Let's see a solid eight and a half out of eleven. I 
this is, this is a few things just falling short, but the banana flavor in here, like off the yeast, is amazing. And the spiciness and the finish is really nice. The mouthfeel, texture is all good. I say eight and a half, but it's not it's not shit beer. Like I don't know. Let's say I wouldn't be scared to buy it. Try it out. Eight and a half out of eleven. And I'm out. Yeah.